to right now with flash flood watches especially yes. up north. Yeah, we've been having those watches around for the past few days now, picking up a lot of rain in these locations, and we have another flash flood watch in effect today for the northwestern part of the state and also southwestern Colorado until 11 p.m., but not too much going on there right now. This is a look at the radar, and you can take a wider look around the state, and uh, you can see not too much going on up there, but later this afternoon or the next few hours, we'll likely see more showers and thunderstorms start to pop up there. Right now, most of the activity west of Socorro and also down to the south and east along the Sacramento, starting to see some activity start to pop up there, generally moving on to the east. So here's a look at your weather headlines. Rain stays mainly to the north today. That's where we'll see the potential for flooding. Temperatures are increasing in the south, but everybody looks to get dry as we head into the weekend, and you'll see that coming up in just a little bit. Here's a look at Superstorm Track as we go through the day. We'll start at lunchtime today. We'll see showers and thunderstorms continue to pop up, mainly up in the northwest, also over in the northern mountains here. We could see a few showers and thunderstorms develop over in the northeast. As we go into tonight, any shower and thunderstorm activity that surrounds should try to dry out, but then going back into Wednesday, a cold front's going to be approaching, and that's going to bring an even better chance for showers and thunderstorms across the northern mountains and into the northeastern plains, and we could even see uh, some of that activity try to develop north of Albuquerque. So we'll watch for that, but again, our rain chances overall are diminishing over the next few days, and again, like I mentioned, temperatures are going up. Here's a look at the numbers right now. 90 in Clovis, 90 in Roswell right now, 80 in Albuquerque, and 80 in Santa Fe. Temperatures will climb into the low 90s and then to the upper 90s down in the southeast this afternoon. So it is going to be a hot one, and temperatures will continue to climb. For the northwest, scattered thunderstorms this afternoon with highs in the 70s and 80s, 86 in Farmington, 84 in Grant. Your extended forecast for Durango and Farmington show still a decent chance for rain through Thursday. Then those rain chances tapering off with highs in the mid-80s and overnight lows mainly in the 50s as we head into the weekend. In the southwest, we'll see a chance for a few spot thunderstorms here this afternoon with highs in the upper 80s, upper 90s down in Las Cruces and Lordsburg and in the southeast. Uh, here, we're staying nice and dry just dealing with the heat as high pressure builds in over here with highs in the upper 90s and triple digits. Your Roswell extended forecast, not a drop of rain in the forecast here with highs near the century mark all the way through the end of this work week with lows in the upper 60s. In the northeast, a chance for a few thunderstorms today, a better chance tomorrow with that cold front approaching. Expect highs in the 90s with overnight lows in the 60s. And in the northern mountains, we could see a few pop-up thunderstorms here in the next couple of hours with highs in the 80s and overnight lows in the mid-60s. Your Santa Fe extended forecast cash is a better chance for rain with that front pushing in on Wednesday and Thursday with highs near 90. Then going into the weekend, we look drier with highs right around 89 or 90 degrees. In the East Mountains, a chance for a few thunderstorms this afternoon, mainly isolated in nature. I really think most of our rain chances will be limited in the uh, East Mountains and also in the metro area. Temperatures, though, will be warmer. We'll top out in the low to mid 90s with just a small chance for some spot showers and thunderstorms. Your extended forecast is temperatures right where they should be for this time of the year in the low to mid 90s with, with our rain chances are uh, very slim on the isolated side. So we're sort of normal. Yeah. I guess. Back to normal. Okay, <laughs> Kristen, thank you. Today is the 2010 National.